it's James from HME Media Video Trainer here. In today's video we're going to look at how to add subtitles to your videos using Adobe Premiere Pro. So um, in order to do this, obviously launch the program, put your clip uh, or your footage onto the timeline. So I've got a video here where I'm walking around a local wedding venue. Um, which is a video that we've used on social media for Wedding Reel, which is our sister company. Um, so make sure that's on the timeline. Then click on the project tab just over here on the left. And then you want to click down here on the new item. And then we want to go up to captions, so click on that. We've got different kinds of captions, so um, different standards. We're going to choose open captions. And then this will default to the uh, frames per second sequence settings. Um, so just make sure that's, that matches your clip. Uh, it will always default to whatever the settings are on sequence, so it should be fine. And then click OK. Then you'll notice over here on the left, you've got the um, open caption, so just pick that up. I'm just gonna drag that onto an empty row on the timeline, and then we're gonna drag that out to the length of, of the footage that we want to add the captions to. So we're just gonna zoom in using the bar at the bottom just so you can see a little bit more detail on what we're doing. And if you look here, you can see we've got the first caption title. So what we're gonna do is double click on the open captions, like so. And there's a couple of things you can do here. You can change the background color. So you can choose any color you want. Your background color, so you might want to do that, for example. And um, let's change it back to black. You can also change the opacity and make it completely disappear. So if you just want the text to be uh, sitting on top of the video, so you just click here on the opacity and then either drag it down to zero or just set an amount by typing in. So again, you can see it's sort of 50% opacity, but we're gonna get rid of that. So for ease, what I normally do is listen through the video and then create what's called sort of a transcript of the video, which is basically all of the um, narration from the video in a Word document. So I've got that here and I've got the first couple of lines of dialogue saved. So I'm just going to do Command C to, to copy that. Go back in here and then we're literally just going to paste that in. And then you can see over on the right it's appeared on the screen. So we're going to listen to that and then we're just going to make sure that we've lined up um, what I'm saying with the uh, subtitle that's appearing on the screen. Hello, I'm James from Wedding Reel. We're here today. So there you go, so you can hear from here. We need to put in our second line. So we're just gonna pull that back. So that finishes there. It's a Wedding Reel. And then we're gonna go back. And down here, we're gonna click on Add. I'm gonna add in our next line. So again, because we've got a Word document set up, that in like so and then we can just adjust the length of that to fit so listen to this Wedding Reel we're here today at Parkland's Wendell Hall so I'm just going to extend that out and then when you're ready click add and either type in or add in the next one as I say I've cheated by copying and pasting it in which just makes it look easy again so back to the sequence Parkland's Wendell Hall where we are one of the recommended weddings just going to extend that out so that it matches and again all you've got to do is just adjust the position of these um, bits of text on the subtitles just so that it matches exactly what's being said on the screen. Hello I'm James from Wedding Reel we're here today at Parkland's Wendon Hall where we are one of the recommended weddings. It's a little bit juddery um, the computer's having a bit of a bit of a moment but as I say depending on the processing power of your computer um, and how many different things you're running in the background that should run a lot more smoothly uh, depending on what you're doing. So there you go, that's it. That's how to add um, subtitles onto a video. Um, these are really important. Obviously something like 80% of people scroll through the timeline on social media without um, actually putting the sound on. So having subtitles for all of your online content is really, really important. Um, as a rough gauge, we tend to take about half an hour to um, sort of transcribe and then add subtitles on for one minute of video. So just to give you kind of a benchmark, um, obviously that's based on, on our sort of video editors who do this 
Monday to Friday, um, every day of the week throughout the year. So obviously we're really, really quick at this. Um, you may find it takes you a bit longer to begin with, but you may get quicker um, at that. Or you may be a superstar and you may be really, really, really quick at adding subtitles. Um, if you don't fancy doing it, there are uh, services like Rev.com which will transcribe um, your videos for you. You can upload the video and then they'll transcribe it and then it's up to you to kind of paste the, um, the text back in and do the bit that I've shown you here um, to match that up. Or you can just do it yourself on here if you want to save money. Um, if you don't fancy the sound of any of that, um, then it's something that, that we can do for you. Um, and we. We do sort of, as I say, about a minute of footage takes us about half an hour. So if you're interested in getting us to do that for you, um, obviously as a professional video company that does this every day of the week, then, then we're able to help with that. Um, and there's a link um, to find out more about that at the bottom of this, and also some links to give you some more hints and tips on uh, filming and editing to help you to sort of get the most out of your video making. So I hope you've enjoyed that, hope you found that useful, um, and I'll see you on the next video.